Hi beautiful Aquarius, welcome back to the channel everybody. If you're new here, I welcome you. We're going to do a weekly uh, read for Aquarius. Please know that I would really appreciate it if you guys would like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I have a lot of views, but I know people are not uh, subscribing and it really helps the channel grow. It helps me pick up on your energy. So please take the time out to do so. Passion. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it. What's going on for Aquarius? The past is now behind you. Release it and embrace the new possibilities. A new path is now available to you. Follow it with faith. Leaving the past behind. Embrace the new. You Somebody is very passionate. It's around you. Enjoy it. I'm just saying leave the past behind. Follow it with faith. Aquarius. Aquarius. Aquarius messages, spirit, what about Aquarius? Very specific. Aquarius. Look deep within your heart and you will feel my love. For my love for you is as deep as the ocean. Either someone loves you deeply, Aquarius, or you are in love with someone deeply. It's a soul connection for that deep of love. Let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims, it simply allows and gives. One more message, Aquarius. Manifesting miracles. <laughs> Aquarius, your dream is soon to become a reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. So you already know within your heart of hearts uh, that there is a deep, deep soul connection here. Angel, your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. Yes, a fire. Let go of emotional upheaval and embrace the renewal of the present. Yeah, unity, a time of divine understanding, renewal, peace, and hope. You radiate and attract great love. Uh, there's this passion here with this angel. This angel is saying, you're being guided. Time of divine unity, understanding. Something had to be let go of. Pay attention to your intuition at this time and move ahead confidently. You will soar toward your destiny and greater clarity and strength. Wow, powerhouse for Aquarius. 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 Miracles. I can't make this stuff up, guys. I couldn't if I tried. Expect the wondrous to emerge. Uncovering treasure beneath the surface lies great bounty. Wise leader, you're a beacon for others. You're being led and guided toward something huge. Finding sanctuary, opening to your spiritual source. Aquarius, vast vistas, expand your horizons, and travel lightly, simplify your life. Step into your power, you're strong beyond measure. Take vigilant courage here, take action with passion. Ooh, get the big picture, view from above. Surrender to the journey, 
release control you can't uh, and stay grounded go deep explore your roots substance here i'm hearing take shelter the answers are within in the flow everything is smooth sailing get ready for new horizons this is what this is saying new horizons new beginnings it could be a vacation choose your path because all is possible beginning of a new cycle first light brand new new beginnings i'm liking it aquarius Aquarius. Change. Have the courage here. It has huge potential. Something has to change. The truth. Seeing the truth. Be courageous. Everything is crystal clear. Everything is, the truth has been illuminated. Take leadership. Mm-hmm. Healing from chaos. It's like... And embrace this stillness. Things could have come to a standstill. But you're just being urged to relax, to purify, and to go for your wish fulfillment. Your wishes are being fulfilled. With this openness, it's time to be open. To head out the gateway to a new life. That's what it's saying. You will have nothing but success. And security is here for you. So I can't see where, a cure, where Aquarius can lose here. I mean, it's so straightforward. Aquarius messages, please, spirit. Those are beautiful messages. Manifesting miracles, success, healing, setting out on new adventures, enjoying the peace, the stillness. Everything's been made crystal clear. Leaving healing from chaos. Mm -hmm. Aquarius. Hmm. Yeah, leaving this chaos behind and seeking a passionate new beginning. There is lots of passion here to come out and it's unity. It's going to bring you in success. So Spirit saying, go for it. Leave the chaos behind. This is your destiny. That's your card, Aquarius. Wishes being fulfilled and granted. Miracles. It is wish fulfillment. Leave these burdens behind. Choose your path. This is a twin flame. Ignoring... Spirit saying you can't keep ignoring. You have to follow your intuition. You already know. It's like you, you're sad over here and you are being blessed over here. It's like trust your intuition. Your intuitiveness side already knows. <clears throat> Stable, grounded. And like, your ships are coming in. It's like you want to work on this. Because this was a karmic energy. This is somebody. This is a karmic energy. That's why it's so chaotic. It is not meant for you. There is, however, something that is meant for you here. That's going to bring you nothing but a nightmare. This is a, yeah, feeling financially stuck or like, what do I do? I've invested so much time and energy, but it's not going anywhere. 
this is a situation, it, it doesn't matter what you do, you're never going to achieve what it is that you need to achieve by staying with a karmic energy. You will not get the wish fulfillment when spirit is clearly defining your path and saying it's right here. You cannot, yeah. And it's like there's anger, there's manipulation, and you're being urged to go forward because this is nothing but lies, deception and manipulation. And that's all it will ever be. Just saying. But someone sits there, uh, got to make a decision. But you will have a victory if you just plan and strategize and take action. It's like you go looking, but it's like you yourself don't trust who this person is. You don't trust them. They put you through a roller coaster of emotions and they are not to be trusted. They're a karmic. They're going to bring nothing but chaos until you remove yourself. You are being divinely protected and watched. So let spirit be spirit and follow the advice. Let that tower hit because if you don't, spirit's going to. And it's a lot easier if you surrender to the journey and let the tower fall than if spirit does it. Because spirit's going to make the tower fall anyway. You can fight it off all you like and be indecisive all you like, but it's not stable. It's going to crash anyway. And when spirit does it, you're going to like it a whole lot less. This could have been a family situation, but it's a trap. It'll bring you nothing but hurt. It'll make you stronger if you get out of it, but you got to move on. Words do hurt. Hurtful words, hurtful communication. It's like you being urged to move forward. But it's like somebody holds back. Oh, what? Go toward your dream. Blessings. Is with someone else. A queen of wands. That's a go-getter. Somebody who is your match. We have the king and queen of pentacles here. You're both the same. It's a blessing. Someone needs to walk away and ghost this family situation because it is not a family situation. It's based upon a lie, a deception. It's going to fall anyway. Someone is soul-searching about the situation, stressing out about money, the kids, all that stuff. This is karma. It's like you have a destined soul mate. This is a past life connection. We are talking about coming into your future. It is a past life soul mate that is a true blessing to you. So it's like somebody's so busy over here worrying about, your, you, you know, it's an energy of like all this stress and all this chaos. And it's like it goes around and around and around. It doesn't improve. It will eventually fall. And you could miss your soulmate connection by dealing with this. That's an empress. This is the truth, Spirit is saying. Justice, happiness, see the truth. This is a divine union. But this... This 
emperor keeps looking at this third party because of finances. This is the truth. When they're in love with someone else. There's going to be a painful ending with that third party. That is the truth. They're being backstabbed. They're being betrayed. There's nothing that's good going to come of this karmic uh lesson nothing it's just a broken record that will repeat and repeat until you've been hurt enough times that you move on from it it's a karmic lesson it yep it'll lead to nowhere but heartbreak travel lightly go toward your lover the one you're passionate about and end things there. It's this clear walk away. They're lying. They're cheating. They're deceptive. Get the courage and strength because it's coming around. Okay? It's here, Aquarius. Take care, guys.